Officers from the Directorate of Criminal Investigations have arrested the principal of a secondary school in Machakos County on allegations that she shared the KCSE mathematics paper 2 on her WhatsApp status hours before the exam started. Meanwhile, Education Cabinet Secretary Professor George Magoha has assured all KCPE candidates to expect their results in two weeks. Sharon Baranga with the details. The day started off well for Beta Mutuku, the principal at ABC Kiseveni Secondary School in Machakos County. What she didn't know was that she would be receiving visitors who would totally change her day. In the morning when KCSE candidates were sitting for their mathematics paper one, officers from the Directorate of Criminal Investigations arrived at the school after they were informed that Beta had shared the KCSE mathematics paper two on her WhatsApp status hours before the exam started. It is reported that she intentionally posted the exam paper on Monday evening for the candidates to study overnight before they sat for it. Claims she denied. It was in your status. No, it was sent to me, but by even a number I don't know. The one that is not even in my phone. Who, who sent to you? I have, I have the number. Everything I can ask you. Let us get that number. No, 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 forget about that. I know, I know. We don't want a lot of stories. Okay. You hand over the phone to us, and we don't have that number. Oh, yes, it's just. Oh, you have your deputy? Yes. Give me this one. You have to call your deputy and hand over the Police officers were not satisfied with her responses, and so they confiscated her mobile phone before arresting her. The principal has told us that uh, he doesn't know who put the exam in her status, but she has confirmed to us this is the ongoing paper. We have also confirmed, we have gone in the classroom, we have found it is the ongoing paper. So what we have decided as investigators, we are going to the police station with her in the DCI. We are going to investigate the matter. We are just going to handle her phone to the, to the cybercrime DCI headquarters so that we can go, we can know where the exam originated from to go to her status in the WhatsApp. Otherwise, so far, we do not know the originating point of the examination to her phone. She has confirmed to us she was just alerted by the intelligence people that her status has got to the national examination. We are commencing our investigations, and we shall, if we find out that uh, she is the one who put it herself, she will just face the law. The second paper is the one that is usually under attack. But we have ensured that that attack is thwarted and that even if you are able to get a few crooks to sit for the paper, they are unable to get the paper back to the children in the examination hall. This is happening in about 0.001%. The annoying thing is that it is taking quite a bit of our time. In Kisumu, the Education Cabinet Secretary was supervising the distribution of the examination papers to centre managers. The CS assuring the KCPE candidates class of 2020 that they will be receiving their results in two weeks. In the inside of the next two weeks, the results will be out by that time. Should there be any change for any particular reason, We'll let you know. Like I said, we are on track. Currently, the examiners marking the KCPE exam are working on insha and composition papers. Sharon Baranga, TV 47.